Hi everyone, I'm Elijah. Welcome to Music Greatness. And for today, we have I wish I knew how it would feel to be free. And it goes just like this. Okay, for this first part, I'm going to break down the intro of the song. We're playing in the key of B flat, in the key of B flat major. And let's directly start and break down bit by bit this intro. It goes like this. Two, three, four, one. Two, three and four and one. Two, three and four and one. Two, three and four and one. Two, Two, three, four. So I'm starting with this E flat over F chord. But here I'm going to remove from my right hand the E flat note. Okay. Uh, so I'm left with F on my left and G and B flat right hand. I'm going to play F with my pinky, G and B flat with my thumb and second finger. So we have this. I'm going to play that on the fourth beat. One, two, three, four. And then first beat, I'm landing on B flat major. So B flat on the left, B flat, D and F right hand. Then I'm going to continue with this movement from D over F sharp to G minor. So D over F sharp, I'm playing D major on my right hand, first inversion. So that's F sharp, A and D, right hand. And then for the left, I'm playing F sharp. So first off, I'm going to play the chord. And then I'm going to change the top note from D to a C. So here, I'm playing an F sharp diminished chord, leading to G minor. That's G on the left, G and B flat again, right hand, just like we did for the first chord. So, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, and four, and one. All right, then we have this. So, again, I have E flat over F. Now I'm going to remove the fifth, so B flat. And I'm left with F on the left with E flat and G, right hand. Okay, then I'm going to switch to A flat and B flat on my right hand, still playing over F. And here I'm actually playing B flat seven with F on the bass. So I'm going to remove this F on my right hand and also the D. So I have the seventh and the root note. So F, A flat, B flat. And I'm using my pinky again on F, fourth finger and pinky for my right hand. A flat and B flat. Just like this. Then I have a regular E flat major. E flat, E flat, G, B flat. Going back to E flat over F with F on the left, E flat, G. And from here, I'm going to switch the G to a B flat and play F, E flat, B flat, finishing on a B flat major chord, playing it with a grace note. That's octave B flat for the left, and the grace note is from C sharp or D flat to D. I'm using my second finger on C sharp and my thumb on D. Just like this. Okay, from the top. One, two, three, four, one, two, 
three and four and one, two, three and four and one, two, three and four and one, two, three, four. Once again, two, three, four, one, two, three and four and one, two, three and four and one, two. Three and four and one, two, three and four and one. So before going back to B flat major here, I'm playing this movement. That's F, G, and B flat on my right hand, and playing G followed by B flat. I'm going to double with F on my left. So I'm playing F twice here. Like this. Then I'm back on B flat major. Like I played before. Followed by this. So I played E flat major. Second inversion now. E flat on my left with B flat, E flat, G right hand. Quickly followed by B flat over D. So B flat, D, F, now playing with D on the left. Back to B flat major, now playing B flat 6. So B flat on the left and right hand, G, B flat, D. So that's almost G minor over B flat, but we're going to call it B flat six. And then we have this. I'm starting with F over A. So A on my left, F A C, right hand. Moving to B flat, now playing on its second inversion on my right hand, so F B flat D. And now I'm going to play F again, F, A, C, but I'm going to start on my left with natural B. But I'm going to end up playing C afterwards. So start with B on the left and then move up to C. And after playing the C, you're going to reach down to play C Again, one octave lower. Just like this. So. Then from here, play B flat E, leading to F7. That's F and E flat for the left, A and F right hand. The root note, the seventh, the major third, and the root note again on top. Then you have this. One B flat followed by F and C, played at the same time. Okay, let's count. Two, three and four and one. 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 Two, three, four. One more time. One, two, three and four and one. Two, Three and four and one, two, three and four and one, two, three and four and one, two, three, four. Perfect. Let's continue with the next bit. We have this two, three and four and one.
Okay, up until this point, we were playing in this register on the keyboard. Now we're going to move slightly up. So we have this. That's F, G, B flat, right hand, going to a grace note, D flat, or C sharp, leading to D. And playing the grace note, I have B flat on my left, up here followed by F on my right hand. So I'm using the same finger for the grace note, my third finger. Simply sliding up and then playing F with my pinky. And that's B flat major. I'm playing the root, the third and then the fifth. Then I have this, that's F sharp followed by D on the left. And I'm going to play D followed by C on my right hand. So F sharp is played with D and D on the left is played with C. Going to G minor, so G and D for the left. And this back and forth on my right hand. Very quickly, play B flat, C, and then back to B flat. Okay, then you have this. So I'm playing one D alone, and then I have G played with F on my left. Okay. Then I'm going to play this, A flat on the left with F and B flat right hand. Going to a regular E flat major, just like we did before, but now one octave higher. And then I'm going to follow with this movement. play E flat, then play E flat alone, and B flat. So I'm using my second finger on E flat and then my thumb on B flat, right hand. And playing the B flat here, I'm going to replay E flat on my left. Then I have F on my left, I'm using my thumb, played with E flat and G, like this. After that, I'm going to play F and B flat again, alone. And after playing those two notes, I have F down here, so one octave lower than this F on my left, followed by this, D flat up to D. So second finger, thumb, and playing D, I have B flat on my left. Okay, from the top. One, two, three, and four, and one, two, three, and four, Two and three and four and one. Two and three and four and one. Okay, then you have this. So I'm going to play B flat with D on the bass. That's D for the left. D, F, B flat, right hand. Moving up to E diminished. E on the left, E, G, B flat, right hand. Then I have this movement. I'm going to play twice D flat on my right hand using my second finger. And then I'm going to move up to D 
with my thumb and play after that F, B flat and D. All the three notes at the same time. Okay, and for the left, playing the second D flat on my right hand, I'm going to play E and playing D, I'm going to play F. And with the B flat played, F, B flat, D, I have F one octave lower. So for the left, you have E, F, F. Move into this. So that's again F sharp diminished. So F sharp on your left with F sharp AC. And then G minor. G on the left, D, G, B flat, right hand. So play F sharp diminished or G flat diminished twice and then land on G minor. And then here, you're going to play a break on octave B flat using your right hand. Okay, just like this. And then after that, you have E played down here on your left. followed by this movement. So the movement that I'm playing on my right hand is actually based on a simple melody line. I'm playing this, that's B flat, C, C sharp or D flat, going up on D. but I'm going to add some notes to it. So playing B flat, I'm going to add D and B flat. So this. Then for the rest of the notes in the melody line, I'm going to play with B flat up here. So C with B flat, D flat with B flat, and finally D with B flat. When I'm going to land on D, I'm going to play F on my left. Okay. Like this. Then, right hand, I'm going to play B flat, followed by F, replayed on my left, and then G, right hand, going to this. So I'm using both hands here, I have C on my left, F and C right hand, and I'm playing those two notes with a grace note, B flat leading to C. I'm using my third finger on B flat, pinky on C. I'm going to finish the intro playing over B flat major. B flat on the left, F, B flat, and D. Okay, let's replay it. One, two, three, and four, and one, two, three, and four, and one, two, and three, and Okay, before the recap, let's replay the entire intro slow tempo. One, two, 
three, four. Perfect, now let's recap and play this intro at full speed. And that's all for this first part. For the rest of the song, please head over to musicgreatness.com. As always, thank you for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one.